but we will get you in rehab though. Because we see you on up top. If y'all click the link up top, he is the only person moving that fast on stage and he was trying to take over Boosie's show. Change my cousin Byron. Because, like, we got to talk about this right quick. Because it's like, it's getting kind of crazy. Like, it's, it's unheard of, man. It's kind of crazy how uh-huh. my last name and Byron's last name is the same. Crazy. And, and we both not going for this type of shit. It's only two of us doing this. That motherfucker done had 35 niggas speak against me and y'all complain. Stronger than me and dude. Niggas got rap. Three. Everybody else, what? Quiet. All y'all other people dick blow. And just take command and do what he asked you to do. Take the money he gave you to talk about the event and lie. And we know damn well it's going to be 90 to 100 rooms open like it always is. Now, how about that? That nigga got free money and never told y'all he got it. Just kept war going and said he wanted to kill me. Oh, you ain't gonna kill me, demon. Get some of that money, doc. Uh-huh. And anybody else that wanna fuck with me, we will bootleg your events. I'm petty enough to go bootleg, like, because people support bootleggers. Now, I didn't see John John, like, Back in the circles with calling them for bootlegging. <coughs> I didn't see that. Probably did it. He's the biggest guy, so we all can do it. What the fuck is y'all thinking? The fuck? Why? No. Burn paid for Because I paid for the disrespect. He got the money. And I didn't even tell y'all. He told y'all that. Oh, I'm only beating him with shit, he said. It's insanity. Yeah, so this this year, we not doing that. I nigga told y'all the motherfucking seats almost. Boss, you better stop lying with that dumb ass nigga because you, you next up. You know I don't give a fuck. You next up. Right right when I done with three, I'm going to come see you. We're going to show you what betrayal is. That stupid ass nigga. You was in the room with me all the time. You was standing next to me all the time. That nigga came over there and told you what? A motherfucking lie? Watch this. Huh. Never, y'all, hey, listen. Y'all can play with anybody else, man. Just don't come fucking with me, though. That's all I'm saying, though. That's it. Damn, like, I be running my head into the wall, like, bro, why do y'all be wanting to fuck with me? Stay out the way. I never involved nobody in our shit. He did. Constantly. And y'all kept jumping in. All right, all right, stay in the car. Sit still. Sit still. Now, now, boss, how you gonna explain that with him up top moving that fast? He he was he was feeling himself, man. No, he wasn't. His freaky ass was feeling himself, man. All right, because the bags and bodies niggas had already opened their mouth and said other shit too. I have not went into my playbook yet, y'all. I have not showed y'all any of my moves. Anything I'm saying is already out. Has nothing to do with me. This is this is this is not my playbook. This is what's available. When I start, it gets dark. Others, this is this is PG step to me. You niggas, it's nothing. I told you I got bombs, man. I this, I just make it sound like bombs because I'm so thunderous. Why I'm so serious? Yeah, I'll be having a good time. I'll be having a good time, man. That's it, man. Everybody just said, I, I offer y'all a pumpkin pie. I try to be cool with niggas. Just be cool with me, be my friend. That's it, baby. And it won't no harm come to you. That's it. But I was shocked at so many people in their disrespect. Like, bloggers, rappers. I was like, damn, so all y'all niggas punk, huh? Because I understand, because y'all, y'all know who y'all are. And I get it. I get it now. I get it. Now I get it, because it's like, you, you niggas jump in y'all suits and zip them up. And then, like, that's not a case. Shine, shout out, shout out, shout out to Shine. Me and Shine got a strange thing. We don't get along, but we understand each other. You know what I mean? <coughs> um, y'all niggas jump in these costumes and then pretend to be who you want to be, and that's not who you really are. So when you see that in the masses, y'all all jump in the car together, which makes sense because all y'all niggas is distressed. I get it. I get it. But three letter me, you up first, though. 
Uh huh. You gonna pay for your sins. Yeah. Then I'm gonna go boss. And then I'm going to announce the list of people that I'm going to step on. Because right now, my cousin Byron is getting all you niggas filed who the fuck you motherfuckers really are. And then they're going to put them in front of the table. And then I'm going to put them on a bullhorn and I'm gonna say it louder. I'm black and I'm proud like that. That's the thing. He finds the information. I'm going to bark that shit. It's going to go everywhere and become infectious. That's how it works. We're going to find out who's a fucking freak here. We're going to find out who has fucking fetishes and what crimes that you have been uh, in the mix of. Uh-huh. Then I'll be able to decode the matrix on who the fuck you niggas really are. And I'm going to have a good time doing it. And we're doing it to everybody. The rappers, 40 bars, everybody. Sorry. Everybody must pay. Hmm? All of you. And it's okay. It's okay. Fear comes later, guys. Not right now. Not right now. Okay. All this could have been stopped. It could have been stopped. And it's like, I still have not. I, but like when people be saying, Verb is burning him or Verb is trip. Listen, the footage of him that was up skating, y'all saw his skating footage when he picked his leg up and threw his ass. Y'all saw that, right? You did see that. You, so we didn't see it? Can somebody post it up top? I mean, let me know what's up. Somebody send it to me again? Because it's footage. Sandy got it, I'm sure. We saw, we saw him roller skating. In leather pants, and he picked his leg up and popped his ass. Yes, he did. Yes, the fuck he did. He's in the industry. Right now, clearly on this footage, you press play on, he's on that bop. He's in the industry. They're doing bop, which is what y'all call molly and shit like that. He's up all night. He's partying. This is no longer here, man. Mm-hmm. This is another nigga. This ain't here, man. This ain't here. It's like it's just he just more. Have y'all y'all ain't saw the footage when he when he roller skating he picked his leg up like that? I couldn't have did that. I couldn't have had been throwing an event and put a gay man on the car before a straight man. I couldn't have did that. I couldn't have I couldn't have got away with not marrying a girl that went through a traumatic experience. I couldn't have got away with that. I couldn't have got away with socking girls in the city like, oh, oh, I couldn't have got away with that. Huh? I couldn't have got away with that. So we got to be fair around here, but I want to get, get them some help, though. So we're going to cut that money out. Like, hey, everybody, trust me, I believe I got the word. It'll be quite a few pages available. It would, it would, it'll, it don't make sense. I bought it already. But uh, Jesus took them, took their, uh, that crucif- uh, crucifixion. And I took that so y'all can so see you niggas could be free. But I rose, didn't I? I took that stabbing in the side. You know what? I bled for a second and then it turned gold and then went right back up in my body. And I said, good try, Marks. That's why y'all sent 30, 40 niggas and y'all couldn't touch my garment, nigga. So picture, picture Jesus with his hair braided and guns under his robe. That would be me. Mm-hmm. Tattooed and shit. Like, how you feel about that? You good? How you want to fix it then, nigga? Y'all niggas can't box with God. Your arms are human. Huh? Look what y'all threw at me. You threw everything at me. You threw them funky ass holes at me. And guess what I did? Deflated a bitch. Go in your room. What did I do to you gangsters on y'all bar? Shh. Bitch, that's enough. And you a hoe. And you a hoe too. And you know you all too. See, that's how I carry it, right? And look, there's some people that can't stand it, but they come in here anonymously because they don't want to show their face. That's, that lets me know I win. I mean, because you whole ass niggas got your ears to the door. And you're afraid to walk in because you was a bitch. Say it with me, niggas. All the anonymous niggas. You little hotline callers. Y'all niggas all got your ear to the door. Like, what'd he say? What'd he say? Walk in, pussies. Show thyself. The devil don't like to be exposed. Mm-mm. 